Even with all this craziness happening all around us, residents in the tall city cannot sit back and watch our kids go hungry, which is why they set up this operation to help feed the kids in the tall city. On Saturday, when MISD made the decision they would be closing their school doors due to the corona epidemic, Alexandra Lasoya, who is from the south side of Midland, knew that meant many students who rely on school lunch and breakfast could go hungry. I see the kids, I, I know some of the kids, and I know there's families that, you know, are low income that, especially with all the chaos right now that's going with the stores. Lasoya couldn't sit back and knew there was something she can do. So she called her friend, Chef Malika, who owns Electric Flavor Cafe, to see what ideas they could cook up. Lasoya and Chef Malika both agree it sometimes just takes a simple thought to put things in motion. I just want the kids to get a hot, healthy meal, you know, because a lot of them, you know, I appreciate MISD for doing sack lunches, but for me personally as a mother, I just wanted to give the kids something hot to eat. Chef Malika says these meals are not just your typical sandwich lunches. These students are getting the full treatment they deserve. The meals being handed out to students of Midland include spaghetti and chicken noodle soup. All foods, Chef McGee says, help support a healthy immune, which is important in keeping away COVID-19. When I heard about the regulations and the guidelines and what it took to keep the kid, this virus out of you, it was a healthy immune system. So my thing, hot Cheetos and Takis, that doesn't boost a healthy immune system. You Organizers understand not everyone can make it to their pickup location, yeah. which is why they are offering to deliver these free nutritious meals straight to the student's house. They tell me they are following every guidelines our officials have recommended about this virus. But being a Midlander, they couldn't sit back and let the kids go hungry. I know there's a lot of single moms that can't get here and can't get to their kids at lunch hour or can't take them anything for lunch. And if they have kids at home, you know, it's Hot Pockets or Cheetos or, you know, and we want them to get a hot meal. If you need any help feeding your students during this time, organizers say all you have to do is simply reach out and those tummies will be filled. Reporting for the Connect Network, Alex Valdez.